y'all Caitlin Clark is a history maker, okay? That's all she does. She makes history. <laughs> she was just offered a $5 million contract to play in the big three basketball league. If y'all don't know what that is, that's Ice Cube's basketball league. And it's a three-on-three -three basketball league that consists of retired NBA players and also players that just couldn't land an NBA contract. So they're good, highly competitive players. A female Hooper just got offered a $5 million contract. That is wild. That tells you that her talent is just off the charts. She is different. That girl is different. Y'all, I just have so many questions though. Like, how did this come about? Did she ever play with some of these players? Did she get a chance to, to hoop with some of them to show that she can hang with them? Or did Ice Cube think, hey, this is a good idea to probably shed some light on the big three? Or is it a little bit of both? Because if you guys do know about the big three, you might know that last year he was having some kind of back and forth with the NBA. They supported but they didn't want to invest in it. So without investing in it, Ice Cube felt like they really not feeling it. That's what it seemed like from the reports I saw, y'all. I've kind of added my own little narrative to it. But the NBA wasn't supporting the big three the way that Ice Cube would have liked them to. The league is growing, but at the same time, it could be a lot bigger. Not many people talk about the big three. And maybe it's a business move. Who knows? Like, is Caitlin Clark that good to hang with the dudes y'all i want to watch the games if if caitlin clark is there i want to see what she does now hopefully if she does choose to play in this league she does really well because if she plays a couple games she's not really making a statement doing her thing out there then eventually it'll just slowly sizzle out that that excitement for her to play for the league but if she's killing it boy <laughs> it's gonna be a league to watch for sure and not just because of her but it's just something different and again, she's a history maker. She has such a huge following. People love her. I have talks about basketball at work, rarely about women's basketball, I'll be honest. But when women's basketball is brought up, somebody mentions Caitlin Clark's name. So that tells you right there, everybody knows her. Like, and, and not just women. It's usually men that talk to me about this. They know more about her than me. So if she does play in the big three league, she actually will still be able to play in the WNBA. And Ice Cube is trying to break barriers for women basketball players. Women play in the WNBA season, right? They get their money, but in the off season, what do they tend to do? They go to other countries to get that money. Ice Cube broke America's women athletes should not be forced to spend their off seasons playing in often dismal and dubious foreign countries just to make ends meet. And that's true. It would be great for them to have another option in America, in USA, to be around their family, their friends, and still be able to, to make that money playing the game they love. So this is huge. I hope Caitlin Clark shows up and shows out, and then that'll allow other women to get the opportunity to do the same as long as they have that same talent. Because at the end of the day, you do want top-notch talent in leagues like this, especially when you're offering $5 million. You feel me? So... That's awesome. I'm happy for Caitlin Clark. She is amazing, man. And according to this report, in addition to the $5 million, Clark would also receive substantial additional compensation, incentives in the form of sponsorships and merchandise, and that the league would also permit her to play in the WNBA. She gets the best of both worlds. Girl, you better say yes. Say yes. Represent Caitlin. I know she's going to dominate in the WNBA, but the big three, that's going to be different. And like I said, that's history, man. History. And she needs to do it for her because I know these WNBA players, they're always talking about how much money they make. And it's not enough. Not enough for them. Caitlin Clark, go get your five mil. Go get that bread for yourself. Do it for your family. Set your life up for success. Girl, you're good. She seems smart. She seems like she's going to invest it if she takes it. That's the type of girl I get from Caitlin Clark, y'all. How do y'all feel about this? Go ahead and drop a comment down below. I want to see positive comments. If you got some negativity, take it to another goddamn video, okay? Not here. Not today, all right? I'm China. I who party. If y'all like this content, go ahead and like, comment, subscribe, all right? Until next time, I'm out.